Is it possible to create a SaaS in just 24 hours? The SaaS, software as a service business model, has become a dominant force in the tech industry. And it's no surprise that every major player is gravitating towards it. The SaaS business model has the highest margins, the biggest scale, and predictable revenue. Now, as a freelance developer, I personally believe what's most important in building apps is to work smarter and not harder. So to make that possible, I'll show you the four-step framework I used to build a fully functional SaaS in just 24 hours. And don't worry, the way I build it can be learned in a matter of weeks and not years, as traditional coding requires. Now, in order to build this app, we'll be using a platform called Bubble. Bubble is a no-code platform that lets you build fully functional web applications without needing to write code. It provides a visual editor for designing user interface, setting up workflows for app logic, and managing databases. Bubble is ideal for entrepreneurs, startups, or developers who want to quickly prototype or build web apps without the complexity of traditional coding. It empowers you to focus on solving problems and launching ideas fast. With that out of the... What? You started already? Then we should too. Let's jump straight into it. Every app needs a strong foundation, just like a house. The database is the brain that powers everything. The login page is its front door, and the settings let users control. If this part isn't solid, everything else will fall apart. Over the next three hours, I will build the backbone of my app. In Bubble, I created a database with tables for users, events, analytics, and subscriptions. This is the foundation where all your app's data lives. Next, the login page. Using Bubble's built-in tools, I set up workflows to handle user access. This is your app's front door. And finally, the settings page, where users can adjust their preferences, like enabling notification or updating personal details. Now your app has a solid foundation. The data is stored, users can log in, and the settings are customizable. With this backbone in place, we're ready to... Okay, I'm trying. Let's move to the next step. Your app's design is the first thing users notice. This can make or break their trust in your app. A clean and professional look will tell the users your app is worth their time. In this step, I design the landing page, build visuals to the login and subscription pages, and set up Stripe and Paywall to start generating revenue. I design the landing page in Bubble with the hero section, info sections about the app's features, and bunch of call to action buttons. It's simple, but effective at grabbing attention. I used Figma to design eye-catching thumbnails for the login page and subscription screen. This phase adds a professional branded touch to your app. Then I set up a Stripe paywall to handle subscriptions and get the app ready to make money. Now your app doesn't just work, it looks great and it's ready to convert visitors into paying customers. Next, it's time to... One second. Next, it's time to bring the core features to life. This is where the app starts to bring real value. The core features, calendar, scheduler, and analytics not only solve the user's problems, but they make them obsessive about it and come back. And over the next hours, I build the tools that make the app truly useful. I used Bubble's calendar plugin to quickly set up a user-friendly way for managing events. Users can view, create, and update their schedules with workflows handling all that logic. For the scheduler, I made templates tailored for different platforms. Users can pick a design optimized for Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, and more add their content and schedule posts with just a few clicks. Then I added an analytics dashboard using a chart plugin. It tracks event stats like user activity and trends, giving users insights at a glance. With these core features, the app is truly solving a problem. Users can organize their time, schedule events and track progress all in one place. Next, we'll focus on testing and polishing everything. This is it, the final step. After hours of building, testing, and tweaking, 
it's time to reveal the app. The little things like fixing bugs and cleaning up the layout, layout make a big difference. These final touches make sure the app feels polished, professional and ready for users. I tested every feature to make sure everything works smoothly. No broken workflows and no errors. At the same time, I optimized the app for mobile, adjusting layouts so it looks great on any screen. It's all about making sure the app works perfectly and feels seamless no matter how users access it. We did it! After 24 hours, the app is finally complete. It's crazy to think how it started just an idea and now it's a fully functional app that's ready for use. Come on, let me show you the outcome. Let's see what I made in just 24 hours. I'll walk you through the whole thing. So we have the landing page here, the hero section, some info sections about the product, the subscription card and reviews. Now we'll press on the button grow your audience. It will send us to the login page. Here we'll enter some details. We'll test it. Now we're inside the dashboard. We have a clean calendar, the scheduler when we can schedule some posts, the account that we can customize. But first of all, let's subscribe and check the Stripe functionality. And let's pay, see if everything works. Oh, thanks for subscribing. They even greet us. And now let me walk you through scheduling a post in YouTube. I'll put a nice thumbnail, a description that I prepared in advance. Write a compelling title like this video. Publish it in a week. Write some tags for the SEO and hit publish. So here we have the post that we just scheduled. We have the thumbnail, the title, the description, all the tags that we added. And let's say I want to add a note, add another option for thumbnail. Let's say I didn't like this thumbnail and maybe we want later to make another one. So I went ahead and scheduled some other posts for YouTube and Instagram. We can see here all the posts, nice thumbnails, look like my YouTube videos. That's it. That's the product that I built in just 24 hours. I think it's decent for 24 hours. It's not something users will straight up pay for it, but uh, you take it from here, step by step, iterate, add more features, and eventually it will be the next great thing. Now it's back to you, me. Now you can build it too. You don't have to be a coding expert or have a huge budget if you have an idea and the determination to follow through, tools like Bubble make it possible. Okay guys, thank you for watching and sticking until the end. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you want me to build an AI content generator or some other in-depth tutorial, comment down AI below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Until the next one, peace. I think it's nice.